Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. So today we are going for the um well this achievement. I don't like sand. So the goal for this achievement is actually pretty simple. We just have to have the most development in the world with only desert provinces. So the best country in my mind to do this with would probably be the Mamluks, because they're kind of uh, centrally positioned near uh, all the desert over here and over here. All right, first thing we're gonna do is uh, embargo Venice for the mission. Uh, there we go. That gives us permanent claims. So we'll just, there we go. See, claims in some desert right off the rip. Perfect. So uh, make these guys a vassal, and let's go to war right away in December. Coastal desert, there we go. Coastal desert, coastal desert, coastal desert, coastal desert, yep. All up in here. Let's go. I mean, currently we're sitting at, uh, doesn't say here. Oh yeah, 361 death. So, fuck, we need to get more than the Ming, damn it. That needs to be an explosion ASAP. This might take longer than I thought. Declare war now, and take that. We're going to take these guys non co belligerent, I don't mind. And while we're at it, let's just declare war on these guys, too. I mean, his and Kaifa denied the call. They must be in another war or something. Nope, they just don't like him very much. So, uh. Can you just catch these guys? Otherwise, I'm just going to siege it down. I don't care. So, we'll piece these guys out first, and then we'll piece these guys out for. as much as we can. Finally, catching these guys out. There we go. Nice. All right, in the piece, I want that, and I want that. Perfect. All right, I want all of these, and they're gonna have to wait until these guys stack with them. Now will you accept? No, wait till they occupy it. In the meantime, our next target is gonna be getting these guys as a loyal vassal. That's a lot of money for gifts. That'll do it. All right. Do that, and I want some more money. Okay. Perfect. But increase autonomy, and I want to form an alliance with you when I can. Give me the claims, please. 20 years and permanent claims. I need to get... All of that. That'll give me some claims over here. My uh, rivals have increased. Let's rival... Rival Timmy's. Alright, next month we vassalize these guys and then immediately declare on Beha. Okay, they're a vassal. Leads the mission to get some permanent claims as well as... We inherit Medina. And gain some, or we have a Hejaz Merit Medina, which frees up a Diplo slot. Or we have, yeah, let's have it one vassal. Perfect. Okay. Makes it easier. And now we have a free slot for somebody else to become a vassal of ours. I want Fazan. And we declare on these guys. We have a lot more claims down here now. Clear the war in seven days. That's a good next war right there. Yeah, keep that in mind. We attack uh, Miklop next with all three co belligerented. Send them up there. This guy will attack these guys right away, and these guys will fight them. Actually, no. We'll just beat this up and do this now. Easy victories there. Got two siege ticks for free from that, though it didn't really do much. Okay. He's out of this nonsense. A little bit of money from that. All almost Coptic here, and we are getting into trade company territory. Board all. Okay, let's piece these guys out now. These are all desert provinces, right? No, that's a dry lands. I'm gonna have to create some kind of vassal or something out of these, just so I can uh, feed them the non Ryland or the non-desert provinces. Like all of this shit, which is more most of my dev is gonna have to go somebody. So, well, to start, let's just eat everything we can. Well, I probably should vassalize these guys. That would be good. 
considering they don't have a coastal desert province, and we can feed them the non-coastal stuff down here while we take the coastal desert for ourselves over here. That fort to fall. There we go. All right. I want it all. Yeah, I'm sitting some overextension for a little while, but that's not a big deal. Um, I want to attack Hadramat now. Really? A lot more allies than I thought. And I really wish I had more manpower, but I do not. Of course, ngali has got a lot of coastal desert. I would love to have that. I can just leave them with their provinces and just take the coastal stuff from these guys. I think that's what I'll do. Okay, I'm going to eat as much as I can, and then I'm going to snake through the Timurids, and then I'm going to get the desert up in this area here. If I just eat all of this, I'm sure I'll be able to uh, get as, uh, a good amount of desert. Uh, I could also snake over here and try and get you know provinces off of these guys. But uh, in the meantime, I think I will wait for them to peace out here, offer them the alliance, and vassalize Fazan. All right, let's declare war on Yemen, and uh, I think we're going to take Hadramat without uh, obligerenting them, just because in the ass of their alliance network, and that will get us closer to Mara, who I should start building a supply network on. Um, but the supply network's on these guys at the moment. Yemen, I'm going to vassalize, and I'm going to feed him... Everything that's non-desert. I just want one province from him. The rest can stay. A doll. I just want your coastline. All right, so we peace out Warsangali, and we can make a claim on Naj and Dawasir, right? Or who else am I fabricating on? These guys. That's right. These guys. Once this fort falls, we can peace out. One person cares is Aiden, and I don't care about Aiden. So, then the dip. Get a vassal. I am going to feed you your cores, and I'll reconquest Aiden eventually. Let's grant them one more province. One cool. Right, Naj, which lets me go to work with Yas. Yas is desert, but I can't take them. So, put on the border with Naj. All right, let's hit these desert guys. They have no allies. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hurry, hurry, hurry. One, two. Over these guys ASAP. If I just get one, one simple little claim on them, I'm going to get so much desert. This is all desert. All right, let's piece these guys out. I want everything. Put that up, and and I can declare on these guys now. But things they did ally Ajam. Uh, I can just probably just. Try and piece them out for white piece, and then take Hormuz, I suppose. Manpower is just really slacking right now, but it's a lot of desert, so that's really going to help us out. Alright, get this fort, and then send some guys up here to try and white piece them out of the war. Start building spy work in Oman, because I know I'm going to need to attack them shortly after this war is over. Alright, we got the siege. Let's start marching up this way. Alright, they can peace out. Let's do that ASAP. As much money as you'll give me. Perfect. Get all your asses back down here. Alright, let's declare war on Aiden as well, while we wait for the taking war score on this bad boy. Oh, actually, I kind of would like Dawes here as a vassal first, though. Let's, let's just wait it out. Damn it. I guess we can recover our manpower in the meantime. All right, we can peace out now. I will take all of that. One province is going to go to Dawes here. And when it looks like coalition is manageable, we need to make sure that we fight Oman and Aiden as soon as possible. Um, these guys, not like because of AE. I could influence them if I... Do I have loans? I don't think I do. We can influence them and hopefully make them a vassal shortly. Um, I could also vassalize Araman, which would be a great vassal to make sure the Ottomans don't beat us in development. Let's, uh, we can take Dawes here in the war with Oman as well. Wait for these guys the truce, and I can fight Aiden and Mara next. We're back to building a spy network on these guys. I had a spy network built already, but it, I guess, went down to zero pretty quick. We'll fight Oman and take Mara out as well, and then... Hopefully we can fight Baluchistan shortly. 
and use them as a segue to get up to all this desert up here. We'll just stand through the Timurids into Transoxiana and Uzbek and no guy. I want to stop the Peasant War from happening. I'm going to slack in. And uh, if I can't get the manpower to reach the 50% measure, which it hopefully will at the end of the month here. I do not want Peasant War to fire, so slackening is a good way to get rid of that crap. Alright, let's claim here. Wait for it. Get the diplomat back. 20 days we declare on Oman. And we take Dawasir out as well in the process. Alright, march there. You guys can march here. Get there while I hunt down the stack. Alright, we can peace out now. And I want every province. Timurids, maybe? Going to join the coalition? That's not good. Alright, before this coalition gets any bigger, I'm going to declare war on Aiden for Reconquest. And make Adal a co-belligerent so that I can take their coastal deserts. Mabra will call in War Sangali and Baluchistan. We're going to try and white piece Baluchistan out for now. But we'll see if we can take their desert as well. Oh. Alright. A little fight in the highlands, but it doesn't really matter. I just don't want these guys sieging down my shit. So I'm gonna occupy these guys, then I'm gonna peace out these guys. Honestly, I might take their desert too. I'm in the war with everybody except for War Sangali. All right, here's one fight. Then we're gonna reinforce. They do, but I'm still gonna win. Nice. Victory there. And I'm gonna get them off Alexandria. Alright, one fight here. Now these guys can go and peace out. Well, I guess we'll just chase that army and try and fight somebody down here, I suppose. These guys can get together and fight the rebels. There's the course finishing, and we can get some more national manpower. Very good. Alright, the siege is over here, so let's take the desert and all of the money. War reps, because I can. And they're going to be dead anyways, so let's get rid of that alliance. Cool. Okay, we got the siege done. Let's take that. I want the money. And, no, oh, that's the war leader again. I want money. Do two less and get war reps as well. Yep. Well, I guess I can do that and then take them all in the next war. That's what? Seven dev? I mean, that's not a big deal. I can dev that myself, so... Yeah, I guess I can do that. Shoot. Send the demand. Leave them with that. I get straight efficiency. Sweet. Or everything I can. Castle military access. I wonder, can I get these guys as an ally yet? No, they're at war. Damn it. Okay, well, that's unfortunate. Yas. Little spin work on you. Cancel middle access with you. Oh, the Timur is joined. God damn it. Or Sangarla, you asshole. Okay, uh, I need to get a big ally. So that this breaks up. Honestly, QQ would be, not be a bad ally to have. Let's improve with them. Love these kind of events. Alright, so let's debase currency. And lose some corruption. Perfect. Let me pay off my debt. And then I can also... Nope, not do that yet. But regardless, that's uh, free money. Alright, let's start the Diplo Annexation of the doll. Alright, we got Kara to Alliance levels. Let's offer them an Alliance. And then we're going to start the Spy Network on Tunis. And now we have a friend. We can improve relations with them later. Let's get the spy network built in 14 days. Alright, let's claim on these guys. And then let's also start improving relations with them. Because I want them to leave the coalition. And they're almost to the point where they might do it. So let's do that. In 14 days. Alright, let's use our government. Uh, government type action and get some manpower. You can also get uh, a little bit of ducats as well. 
Okay, so we have a few things to do here. First things first, let's build a spine network or build a claim on Tunis. Claiming this province here. Then, once the diplomat comes back, we're going to offer vacillation to Caraman, who will accept. Perfect. And now, we're going to declare war for this one desert province and uh, take a bunch of money from Ethiopia in a separate piece. All right, piecing Ethiopia out now. Just want this, just that. Perfect. All right, ready to roll on the Tunisians. Well, that was a pretty quick war. Uh, no real battles at all. We just occupied everything and they were scared of us. So we have all of the desert collected and uh, we can just take it. No money at all. But why bother? And nobody is going to care about coalition over here. So let's just do this. I want all of it. I'm going to save my admin mana. And we're going to spend my spine work on Jared. And we're going to immediately declare a war on them as well. Once the CB comes through. And here we go. Nice, quick, and easy wars. And now we have all the desert over here that exists. Our dev is looking decent. 726. So... A lot of that's over here. We're gonna have to get rid of it, so. We need this desert, and we need this desert. And we need the Ming to explode. So that is conditional, I suppose. The rest, I guess we'll have to just dev and pray that the Ottomans don't beat us in total dev, which they're expanding pretty slowly right now, so that's good. Excellent, absolutely excellent. That makes us able to do this, right? Let's wait for the coalition to fall off a little more. Yep, now everyone's leaving. Of course, Ngali's gone. Okay, cool. We're going straight down here, bud. I want these two desert, desert provinces. I want Yas. Let's have you go on the border of Yas here. And let's piece these guys out for every desert province, of course. All right, here we go. Declare the war for these two desert provinces and connect our lands. Awesome. There is an instant revolt. Alright, let's deal with that first, and then let's declare war on Yas next month. This will also allow us to take these two desert provinces from Mara. We full annex them. Alright, let's declare war on these guys too. Once we occupy this, we fight Baluchistan, and we take their desert provinces as well. Alright, let's piece these guys out. I'm not gonna get this province. It doesn't really matter to me. It's a pain in the ass to deal with the ships. So, what is for dev in the end here? A couple, couple you know, clicks for deving, so not really a big deal. Let's core all of that. Well, the boats are finished, so let's march across the strait here. All right, let's piece out of the war here. I want all of it. That's all the desert provinces, right? This isn't desert, right? And these four are cool. I'll take that just a snake here and then start deserting up here. Let's peace out. Sweet. Alright, let's ally Hungary. I just need more defensive allies here. I don't want to get declared by the Ottomans on accident and just be SOL when I'm fighting somebody else, so... Hungary it is for now. Alright, get over here and occupy this as fast as we can, and I want you over here. I'm gonna piece these guys out first. I can just take Kutch. Build some dynamic on these guys. Don't need this anymore. Got caught out in the wrong time, but... Almost just take that. All right, I can take these two provinces, no problem. No, I lost the battles. Nine ducats, too. Look at that. For what I can. Wanted to clear war on these guys ASAP. All right, screw it. Let's just do this twice. Embrace and take all the techs. Still really far behind. You know what? We're going to switch to Milfogus and we're going to take a military idea group. The only one that matters right now, quantity. Make sure to do these clicks again. Egyptian slaves and power cost for one year. Let's use this one. We're about to take tech. All right, claim on this province. We can cancel the spy network. Wait for the 
BB, and let's go to war. Definitely do not call Mewar's allies, and we're just going to take the one province we need from them. And we're going to war. All right. I'm looking for desert only, so we're going to full train. It's just one, two, three provinces, I'm pretty sure. Right? Yep. All right, the war is almost over here. Let's take our click here, get the power cost reduction, and use that to take Miltech. We'll upgrade our cannons, and then we'll start bumping out our military idea. Uh, let's do two value cannons right over here. All right, piece that out. We Now we need to go to war with these for these four provinces. We can just get that easily by just declaring on Jangladesh once we get the spy network for that. Uh, we can't core them yet. We're just waiting on a few more cores, and then we should be good to go. So let's get everybody on the border. All right, and a free 10k manpower. We'll take that for sure. And I think we can declare war in two days. I'm going to declare on these guys and bring in Multan. And these guys I will attack uh, once the spy network is built. Easy sack wipe. Send him there. Send him there. In there. Tyrion, not bad. 606. That's pretty good. We're not really using Diplo power too much, so I will freaking take it. All right. Let's declare war on these guys. We can take them out pretty quickly here. And both these provinces are desert, so. Not even a problem. I think I'm done in this part of the world. Now I need to take the Timurids and uh, get access to all their desert provinces as well. I think after that, I might be enough to uh, surpass Ming. I need another pretty much 300 dev. Well, more than that, actually. Oh, man. All right, let's piece this out. I want both these provinces. Not worried at all. And then I want to piece these guys out for... Make sure those are the only desert provinces, right? Yep, only three desert provinces. Let's get some manpower. Huge click, by the way. 50% manpower. Look at the total manpower. Five, about 50k total. Jumps up to 68 total. That's a huge increase of manpower and monthly manpower gain, which is going to be increased even more when we do this. Quantity ideas are pretty broken. There's a fight. Back wipe. There's some more score. Is that enough? Nope. All right, let's see. Our next tech group. Oh, man. Ah. Uh... I might need this. I really might. Go economic. I might need it. I mean, my economy is pretty crap right now. So. Because my trade is not efficient, but. Yeah. Not efficient at all. All right. Let's finally piece out of this war. Take the desert. Cool. We have all but this desert province over here, which I don't really mind. Three dev. This is really just all I wanted was this little little island out here. These guys are black flag. They can come back. You know what? I'd rather not wait. Um... Let's just do it. Damn. Okay. Well, that about does it for the first half of the I Don't Like Sand Achievement Run. Thank you guys very much for watching, and if you enjoyed that, I will be releasing the second half of this video tomorrow, where you can see how I take on the Timurids as well as the Northern Tribes, and even Ming. So tune in next time, and you will see exactly how I get that done. Again, thank you guys very much for watching, and as always, I will see you next time.